The Miami Hurricanes men's basketball team made it all the way to the Elite Eight last season. This year, they have their eyes on making another run during March Madness. CBS4 Sports anchor Mike Cunha went one-on-one -on -one with a Hurricanes player who missed last year's run and is now back stronger than ever and ready to contribute. and healthier than ever, Hurricanes guard Harlan Beverly. He missed last season's run to the Elite Eight because of back surgery. But exactly one year later, he came off the bench scoring 15 points in a win over Boston College. Up ahead, it's Beverly. Lines it up. How tough and how motivating was it watching that team go that far? Oh, it was very tough and motivating. It was it was hard to watch just because, I, I, of course, I wanted to be a part of it. I wanted to compete. I wanted to get that first-hand experience, how it feels to be on the court in those big games. You'll get that big game experience on Saturday at noon when the Hurricanes travel to Cameron Indoor to take on Duke and the Cameron Crazies. That begs the question, will we see a little craziness from Coach Jim Laranega, who lives for these big locker room moments? Yeah, he saves it for the tournament. He's a, he's a cage lion right now. He hasn't been let out of his cage yet, so he's been relaxing. And we, we're waiting for it, though. The Hurricanes are currently ranked in the top 20, but it took a while for the country to come around on this group. I might hit it first try. But one thing's for sure. They're not short on confidence, and Harlan didn't mind embarrassing me on TV. Oh my God! Second try, second try, second try. Oh my God! I'm just glad you did it before Coach L got into it. Like, what are you doing here? That's around. Here it is. All right, all right. You're the master. You're the master. Now, even though the Hurricanes are hitting the road to take on Duke, they are a perfect 11 and 0 when they play here in Coral Gables. I asked Harlan why that is. He had one simple answer. He said the fans. He said they've really made a huge impact this season. In Coral Gables, Mike Cunio, CBS 4 Sports.